Hi, welcome back. So we're 240 print hours in and I just wanted to let you know how we're getting on. Uh, later on in the video we're going to have a look at some print quality and you can see what that's like. But I really wanted to go over some things from other videos. So the AMS, which you'll have seen the video I did recently, I wanted to go over this because people probably think it doesn't actually work. So if you look there, that's what it's come from, from 60. So it does actually work perfectly well. You need to buy the right stuff. I tried the wrong stuff at first. So this is the stuff I bought. So this came from Amazon. If you type in Trust Leaf Silica Gel, this is a 500 gram pack. It's 995 I think. And it'll do you for ages. It'll do it ages. Also, this is it goes in orange and when you know it's useless it'll go green wait till it's gone green before you chuck it you'll notice your readings go up anyway but that's what i use for that another little thing i've got a light now attached up at the top of here so i have a light bar if you look it's very bright so it's probably going to blow it out so yeah it's like a silicon light bar that goes up there it was seven pounds something from ebay and it plugs in to the back into your ms pot into your second AMS port there and it has a little switch on great value doesn't get hot or anything really good piece of kit I'm still on my original plate I've not even turned it um, I have bought from Bamboo Labs I have bought the one that comes with the stickers I'm going to do a couple of prints on that and the next video will be about this other things I've printed for the printer, that's about it really. Obviously I've printed the cover already for the screen. I do recommend printing the cover of the screen. It's telling me to do my access again. This is the fourth time. I'll hit later because I haven't done that yet. Um, I've done it three times so far. And the other thing I've done, I've printed some more of these clips because I, I felt they were getting out of control a little bit. And the other thing is this thing that goes on here and it's just to stop it shooting past my bucket. It doesn't actually work very well. I'll tell you that, I wouldn't bother printing that one. Uh, the other thing I've had to do is replace this, my nozzle. The first time I had to, it's the first one I've had to replace anything on it. It came up and told me this the other day. This just clips off, simple as that. Uh, two little hooks. So you hook it on at the, I think it's the top that hooks on. And then all you do is push it in place, like that. Just push it back in. You take that off. Here's the little rubber boot that comes off. This little rubber boot clips off here. And then behind there, what you will see is, I'll pull the boot off, show you. And all you do is release that clip there. And then this just pulls out. Literally takes you two minutes to do. Um, buy them off Bamboo Labs. I try and get some more stuff put in your basket because postage is a bit expensive. But if you spend so much money, you get free postage. I'd go for that because... Um, it becomes expensive otherwise. Clip that back on and that's as much as you do. They come in a box like this when you buy them. And these were $10.99 each. I've got two of them because one of these is a 0.4 which is a standard one. And I've also, which is this one. And then I've also got a 0.2. Which is this one. And I got the 0.2 because this does final, finer detail. This is stainless steel, which is like the original one you get it. Obviously, if you are printing in 0.2, slow your printer's print down because it's obviously not going to like printing in 0.2 fast. And the one I put in here is a hardened steel one. You really do need the hardened steel one if you're going to print with carbon, anything with carbon fiber in it. You're going to have to use that. So printer-wise, that's about where we are. Uh, and let's go and have a look at the quality of some of the prints now that I've done. So this is the dragon that I printed and this is a POB print on bed. So it just prints as it is, you don't need to do anything with it. As you can see, all the connect it all moves, completely moves independently of itself. And as you can see the print quality, let's get see if I can get close up. You can see the print quality. So this is printed in 0 
and the reason that it's 0 0.16 is time to be honest it would this took as it was I think it's the 40 this was a 17 hour print I believe so it's a long print but I wanted to do it to see what the quality was like and see what it come out like this is printed in Zyro PLA you can buy it off Amazon I think it's 16.99 and this is the three color one so I really like this because it really does work. So I hope you can see the colour changes. They're fantastic. Well, I think they are anyway. Uh, and this is probably one of the best things I've printed quali uh, quality wise. And the other things I've been printing are mainly model type things and I paint them. So once I've got, ne in the next video, I'll show you more of those that are completed when they're all finished painted. But I couldn't be happier with the printer. I really do think these printers are amazing pieces of kit. And as I say, I've had to go through a nozzle, but you could have run clean it. You could have run the cleaning um, filament through the nozzle. I've got some cleaning filament. You get that free also when you buy Zyro filament. If I'd have run that through, I reckon I'd have been all right, which is why I've kept it and put it in the box, but I was in the middle of a print and I wanted to crack on, so I just changed it. But I hope you can see the quality. I'm so happy with the quality of this stuff. It really is nice. Especially with this, I love this um, three coloured stuff. So yeah, just a quick video today. I just wanted to go through it, tell you my thoughts a little bit longer. But I am going to do some more videos, like I said, moving forward on this. I want to do some on the other plates so I can test them out and I'll let you know what I think. Um, but yeah, all in all, fantastic. Thanks so much for watching. Have a fantastic day.